Pre-Market Summary for Indian Stock Market Nifty 50 Index Futures trading on the Singapore Stock Exchange suggests that the Nifty could rise 323 points at the opening bell. On positive global cues, the market is poised for a strong rally in early trade. On the macro front, the September industrial production and manufacturing production data will be released today, November 11, 2022. Today's results will be announced by Hindalco Industries, Mahindra, and Mahindra, Life Insurance Corporation of India, Sun TV Network, and Z Entertainment Enterprises, among others. Overseas, Asian stocks are trading higher after the release of October US inflation data raised investor hopes that inflation has peaked. After the October reading of consumer prices raised investor hopes that inflation had peaked, US stocks staged their biggest rally since 2020. Last month, price increases in the United States slowed. The Labor Department reported Thursday that consumer inflation was 7.7% year-on-year in October and 0.4% month-on-month. The increase year-over-year was the smallest since January. Excluding volatile food and energy prices, core inflation increased 6.3% in the previous year and 0.3% since September. Meanwhile, U.S. President Joe Biden is expected to meet with Chinese President Xi Jinping next week to discuss Russia's war in Ukraine. The two leaders will meet for the first time since Biden assumed the presidency of the United States, ahead of the G20 summit in Bali, Indonesia. On Thursday, the domestic equity market fell in line with its global counterparts. The S&P, BSE Sensex fell 419.85 points, or 0.69%, to 60,613.70. To 18,028.20, the Nifty 50 index fell 128.80 points or 0.71%. Foreign Portfolio Investors FPIs, purchased shares worth 36.06 crore on 10th of November, while domestic institutional investors were net sellers worth 967.13 crore, according to preliminary data. Follow us, information is wealth.